All right. Now we're doing free code camp. JavaScript algorithms and data structures beta. Learn basic string and array methods by building a music player. Step 23. All right. So to sort the songs in alphabetical order by title, we will need to pass in a complete callback function. Pardon me, a compare callback function into our sort method. So here's an example of sorting a list of fruits by name. So we've got const fruits, and that's going to equal this array with these objects in it. And we're going to have fruits.sort, and then we'll have A and B as the parameter of the callback function, and then we'll have the arrow. And right here, we'll have an if statement if A.name is less than B.name. So whatever, like if this is A and this is B, uh, then we'll return what? Negative one like that. So if apples is less than blueberries, which it is because apples comes before blueberries in that uh, UTF-16 order, pardon me, UTF-15 order, 16, 15, whatever it is. Anyway, uh, and then we'll have if name, if a dot name is greater than b dot name, we'll return a positive one. And if not, if uh, they're the same, we'll just return zero, right? So basically, if it's, if it returns a negative one, they won't switch. If it returns a positive one, they will switch, all right? Because if this is greater than this, like if blueberries is greater than apples, it, they will switch, all right? Something like that. So in the next few steps, we will learn what each of those if statements is doing inside that callback function. But for now, we're gonna add an empty callback function to our sort method and use A and B for the parameter names, all right? So we'll have some uh, parentheses like this. We'll do A comma B. And then we'll do the arrow like this, and then we'll have the empty object. And that's pretty much all we need for right now. So let's check the code. Looks good. And submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 24. And we'll see you next time.